Hi puzzle friends, I'm on vacation and I wanted to show you when I vacation, I do bring my puzzles with me. Right now I'm on this beautiful cruise and we're at sea. So on a sea day, what I do is I stake out a really nice area. I have scoped out the library and it's pretty quiet. I have a table set up in the back there so I'll be able to leave my puzzle while I go do some games or have some snacks and some meals. I did build another puzzle when we were at port out on the open deck and I must say it's a little windy and nerve-wracking that you might lose a piece. So it was only a small puzzle so it worked out all right but today I am working on a much bigger puzzle. It's a thousand piece so it's going to take me a while to do it. Um, so like I said, I'm going to be able to leave this behind while I go and have my meals and maybe play some trivia and some stuff like that. Um, and this puzzle I did finish. Uh, I was up on the wind jammer and we did that. And I'm going to leave it behind here for anyone else who's cruising that would like to do a puzzle. It was just a little snack, so it worked out. So I asked my store for a tray, a box, so that if I have to leave my puzzle or I don't finish it today, that I can actually deconstruct it in sections and carry it back to my room and come back tomorrow. When I'm here, I love this little thing, I play my music. I'm by myself, so I don't disturb anyone. And if I do go away, I did play some bingo. I just wrote a little note and people are pretty nice, so I'll leave my puzzle alone. So the puzzle I'm doing is this cute little cat called The Meow by Sam Hurt. It's by a company that's fairly new, The Puzzled Co. And what's special about these pieces is that they are water jet cut pieces. A new technology for puzzles. Um, we'll see how it, it works. They feel very light. Um, I'm liking everything about it so far. So this is the first time I'm working with pieces that are water jet cut. New technology to me, but I wanted to show you how nicely they fit into one another. Very easy, and it picks up. Pretty cool. Very nice fit. Out and in. I'm doing this with one hand, so don't um, worry about my little struggle there. It is a very nice fit. We're working on two tables. But I realized that I can move this over there. I didn't know how big the puzzle was. So watch this. I can just pick it up and walk it over here. How great of a fit is this? So we're going to take a break. I want to have breakfast. So I had the stroke made me give me this box and he had some scissors so I cut it up. So I'm just going to put it over to protect it. As well as I brought a towel and this is what we're going to do. Just, just leave it like that. Put some of the pieces in. And then I roll a little towel. It should only be gone about a half hour. But if anyone comes, I'm hoping people will be respectful and leave my puzzle alone. what I do and I will come back intermittently four or five times during the day because there's some shows and I want to do some trivia and some games so I'll come back and forth but this is what I do. It's a safe spot. There's not a lot of people that filter through here so um, it should be good. So I've come back and everything looks good to me. Ta-da! We finished the puzzle yesterday. Today I'm going to do a deconstruct. It's going to be hard because I'm on the cruise and I don't have my equipment. I'll have to be creative, but I'll come up with something. Um, the library got quite surprisingly busy yesterday. We had a few people help us, which was really fun because when we got to the dark spot right here, I noticed the lighting wasn't very good, so it was sort of hit and miss, so it was nice to have a few other people take part in it. Pretty puzzle, really happy with it. Pieces are gorgeous, look at that. Um, lies very flat. 
So this is the reel I made for my Instagram account. It was really too hard to do any type of deconstruct on the cruise. So I did this time lapse. It turned out pretty good. I really, really did enjoy this puzzle. It's, it's such a great quality. I did do two other puzzles. This was in the wind jammer and it was nice. It was a nice sunny day. However, it was really windy and I was paranoid of losing a piece. So that's why I moved to the library. I also made a third puzzle and it was in the schooner lounge. The lighting was all right there. However, it was a glass table that I had to work on and, and that was difficult. I love cruising and I will always bring puzzles with me. You meet some people and have a great time.